Nimepatua habari ya kwamba Kenya ikiungana na Uganda na Tanzania tumefaulu kuwa hosts wa Afcon in 2027. Nataka nipongeze wizara yetu ambayo inasimamia michezo na washikadau wote katika sekta hiyo kwamba ile mpango tumekuwa nayo ya kubadilisha mambo katika sekta ya mchezo sasa inaanza kufua dafu many people never believed that we had a chance of hosting afcon in 2027 because of the state of our football and the state of our sports in general but i am very proud today that kenya together with our partners in uganda and tanzania jointly we have won the right to host afcon in 2027 and we are very proud of this achievement we will now mobilize every resource we will mobilize every person and every sector to make sure that we deliver a world class football event in 2027 we will make sure that whatever infrastructural facility that are required will be made available to make sure that we move Kenya to the next level in our sports industry. How much do you know about the upcoming African Cup of Nations AFCON 2027? Are you aware that East Africa is set to play host for the first time in history? Well, buckle up because today we're taking a virtual journey to Kenya, Uganda, and Tanzania, the triumvirate of nations gearing up to host the AFCON 2027. Imagine the roar of the crowd, the thunderous applause reverberating through the grand stadiums of Nairobi, Kampala, and Dar es Salaam. Picture the beautifully manicured football pitches, the vibrant flags fluttering in the wind, and the energy that can only be found in the heart of Africa. In Kenya, we find the Moi International Sports Center, a stadium with a seating capacity of 60,000. It's an architectural marvel and a testament to Kenya's love for the beautiful game. Uganda on the other hand boasts the Mandela National Stadium named after the iconic Nelson Mandela this stadium can accommodate 45,000 football enthusiasts and then we have Tanzania home to the National Stadium a 56,000 seater facility that is as imposing as it is impressive but it's not just about the stadiums the hospitality of these East African nations is legendary Expect to be welcomed with open arms, warm smiles, and the kind of friendliness that makes you feel at home. Immerse yourself in the rich, diverse cultures as you enjoy local delicacies, traditional music, and dance. Hosting AFCON 2027 has significant benefits for Kenya, Uganda, and Tanzania. Economically, the tournament is expected to inject millions of dollars into the local economies, create jobs, and promote local businesses. Socially, it's a platform for unity, fostering a sense of national pride and showcasing the region's cultural diversity. So, to sum it all up, AFCON 2027, set to be hosted by Kenya, Uganda, and Tanzania, is more than just a football tournament. It's an opportunity to experience the warmth and hospitality of East Africa, to witness footballing action in world-class stadiums, and to see firsthand the economic and social benefits that such an event brings to the host nations. So, are you ready for AFCON 2027 because East Africa certainly is? This is Olakara TV.